Our big focus battle for the states begins. Long queues are being seen outside polling stations in the 15 constituencies that go to polls in the first phase in Jammu and Kashmir. Voting began at 8 this morning with people coming out to cast their ballot in spite of a boycott call from separatists. The stakes are high for Chief Minister Umar Abdullah, whose government is battling anti-incumbency. The BJP for the first time has emerged as a serious challenger in the valley, targeting 44 seats in the 87-member assembly. The other big contender is the PDP, led by Muft Mehbooba Mufti, who is hoping to install her father. Mufti Mohammad Saeed is the next Chief Minister. For the Congress, it's once again a fight for survival. All right, our team of reporters are getting us ground reports from uh, different uh, districts of Jammu and Kashmir. Let's cross live. This is a tough competition in Kishwar Assembly Constituency, and we have with us uh, uh, Sajada Malkitru. He is a MOS home also and the National Conference candidate from Kishwar. And, uh, 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 Mr. Kichru, uh, what is the status of today's polling and uh, there is an encouragement, there is no separatist call here? First thing is, uh, I am happy that people are uh, coming to polling stations and participation here. I think uh, it is a big thing that uh, uh, separatists, uh, you know, uh, every time they give call, for boycott. Today, I, I don't think uh, here there is any uh, effect of call. Uh, what is uh, basically, uh, what do you think that the percentage will be higher than uh, in, in comparison to last year assembly constituency? I think in Kishtuwar, uh, uh, the percentage will be more than 80 to 85 percent. Mostly these seats were taken over by the Congress out of six constituencies. Uh, five are captured by the Congress and uh, one is with you. What do you think about this uh, uh, Modi uh, effect on these constituencies? I think uh, National Conference is uh, expecting uh, more than four seats this time in Chinaw Valley. Let's get in a word from our correspondent Shuja Al Haq who is with us live this morning. Good morning Shuja. What's the kind of turnaround that you are seeing around you? Well, uh, Simi, as you can see right now, I am uh, at one of the polling stations and, uh, you know, uh, the mood is uh, here to uh, see for all of us. If my cameraman can pan in a little and you will see the long queues of people who have assembled here at this uh, polling booth in Sumbal's uh, constituency and are waiting uh, for their turns to uh, exercise their mandate. Uh, these people have been, uh, have been uh, queuing up here since, uh, since it's, it's very early in the morning. 7.30 is the time when I, I came at this place and I've been seeing people continuously coming in from all across uh, uh, these neighborhood uh, villages and other areas. So this is exactly the, uh, the, the, the kind of atmosphere we are witnessing in the other adjoining uh, places as well where we have, wit we have so far been able to go. Uh, a lot of people uh, wanting to come out and wanting to exercise their mandate, uh, uh, particularly the, in these constituencies where, uh, which, is, which are going for polls uh, this time in Kashmir Valley. We have uh, mostly rural areas and there is a lot of enthusiasm among people, particularly in rural areas uh, with regards to polling. A lot of people that we spoke to here have uh, only few things in their minds when they uh, talk about uh, exercising their mandate. Most of them are talking about developing most of them are talking about jobs, price rise, and some uh, some of them are also talking about change in the kind of setup that they have witnessed so far. Uh, so that's the that's a precise mood on the ground. Let me also give you a sense of what we uh, actually are facing today. We have act we have five constituencies uh, uh, in Kashmir Valley which are going to polls, uh, four constituencies which are going to polls in Ladakh, uh, uh, very very difficult uh, terrains in Ladakh uh, uh, in, in these cold atmospheres uh, are, are going for polls and six constituencies are going for polls in Jammu division and all from all across we are getting similar reports of enthusiasm among, uh, uh, among a lot of voters, uh, people starting uh, very early and, and trying to make sure that their uh, uh, vote is cast at as soon as possible. Uh, let me also remind you that uh, uh, this entire vo voting is happening uh, in the shadow of uh, uh, threats being given out by uh, militant organizations. Yesterday only we, we have uh, seen how reports of threats were 
uh, coming in and also uh, separatist leadership uh, particularly Hurriyat conferences uh, Gilani faction had completely given a blanket uh, ban on, uh, uh, on, on on polls in exercising the voting they also asked for boycott but on the ground there seems to be an, an extreme sense of excitement towards uh, voting and polling particularly in these two constituencies of Kashmir Valley. Simi? Right, so in spite of those, those boycott calls uh, and uh, the threat of violence, uh, hundreds of people coming out to cast their ballots. Thanks so much for that ground report.